Hey what's up guys, Jack Winsley here bringing us another session of The Godfather 2. We're going to hopefully get a lot further than we did in the last session because, uh, yeah, it didn't really go so well. Just going to jump into this and when I was loading up the game, one of my businesses, yep, there it is, was being lo nice, uh, nicely attacked. So we're obviously going to send our uh, star man and... Uh, Wait, is he... Ah, he's already defending it. So we'll send him then. Yep, send defenders. Okay. So we... Alright. Wow. That was harsh. That was harsh shit right there, man. Right. Not able to take that car yet. So... While we are waiting for him to come back, there is a marked Phagatron that we need to get. Where is he though? Um, is it this guy? No. Oh, these are just favours, I guess. Ah, fuck's sake, now I'm fucking in. God damn it! I'll be back in Florida. Right, there's a guy here that needs fucking taken down. There he is. Let a bruiser shank him from behind. Right, so. Right, so I'm gonna set my waypoint there. Why are you driving like you got a death wish? Right, you finally want to get in the car, mate. We can actually leave. And uh, I'm just gonna make my way over, so hopefully by the time that I actually get to this boy to shank him, uh, we will, he will be finished defending. Yes. Let's hopeful, let's hope, hopefully this works. And uh, I'm gonna quickly, as usual, jump onto this little thing called the map. Oh damn! All right, so may as well just fucking stay on this road. Jesus Christ! We've got a long journey ahead of us. Like, we're on the road again, traveling at the speed of light. I don't know what song I was trying to sing there. You know, when you don't know the lyrics to a song, you just mix and match and hope for the best. Righty ho, righty ho. Hey! Please tell me it's the guy that. And. Add crew. Right. I'm going to add him to the crew to shank and then I'm going to obviously kick him back out of the crew because. Alright, once this guy gets shanked, then I'll probably remove him from the crew, obviously, and add my capital back in. I only need him for the shank. Hey, mate, I got 137. Look how much money I'm losing because of all these people places I've got. Damn. Right. Man, that beat was bouncing. Did you hear that? On my way. Right. You all stay there. I need to be super stealthy. Oh, the concentration levels. Alright, so. You can't get in for this side. Should have thought about that since this is Godfather 2 where they like to fuck you over at every single little opportunity. Let's try going this way then. Yep, this way looks so much better. There we go. Can. That way. Why is he going to crouch mode? Couldn't they figure out how to do it? Which is just awkward as fuck. But you know, I figured it out, so I'm all good. I'm gonna enjoy this. Quick, come on. Where are you? Did I get him? Hit success! Paul Morales, Granado's soldier, is permanently eliminated. Boom! 
That's him down. Fucking yes. Now we just need to take out one more guy. I think. Alright. Um. Right, mate. You've done great as a bruiser. That's why you're in my family. But remove you. You need to leave the crew now, mate. Sadly, you know. Alright, let's leave. We need to find a phone, which is probably going to be the next hardest thing in this fucking game to try and pull off. Right. Where's the car? First off, right, first we'll get in the car, then we'll look for a phone. Oh yeah. I kind of miss New York. Man, I'd give up ten of these Florida skirts just to bang one Brooklyn shit right about now. What are you talking about? You didn't get laid once the whole time we were down here. Oh. Oh, damn. Shots are being fired. Hey, when was the last time you heard from Don Corleone? Hmm. When do I punch out? I this guy's just walking about. Um, please tell me, there must be a phone. You just Michael Jackson at Cool. There must be a phone in this fucking building. Surely. Surely. No. That was an important man in the group. There probably is a phone, but I'm not running through that whole fucking building to look for one because I absolutely hate it. It's like the worst building in the whole game. It's so big. I don't know where I'm going. Let's, fuck it, let's go this way. Ah, oh, for God's sake, they would be attacking. This is where I can test out my new guy because I can select him now and see I can send that defender and he don't have to worry about it. Don't have to worry about losing any important from my team. Let's take this off the map. And we will head out for another phone. Maybe we'll see why I'm just chilling on the fucking highway or something. Oh. There's a petrol station or a gas station or whatever it fucking gets called here. So that must mean that there is a phone. Wait, is it here we're getting attacked? Look at that, it's here we're getting attacked. I may, as well, may as well go fucking help. Hey, who's with me? You go that way. Oh, it's the guy. Here it is. There's only one marked man left. Oh no, he's not even a marked man, it's just one of the main boys. Where is he? Where is he? I don't know, but I think our main guy, uh, the guy that I've got sent over here, can actually do it. Where the fuck is a phone? God damn it, man! There, yes. Dominic, Michael, how are you? Not good. Something's come up. I need you back in New York right away. I'll get on the next available flight. Good. I need your help. I'll see you soon. Uh oh. If Michael needs to see us, that means it's pretty important. Like, you know, fucking pretty serious shit. There's still one boy left, but who knows where the fuck he is. We're just going to make our way to the airport, and hopefully our guy can fucking deal with this, because look how many... I've got a lot of soldiers there to fucking handle this situation, so nothing should happen, hopefully. But, you know... Never know, this these this one boy might just be the fucking terminator and destroy my whole team. Oh look there was a phone. Well actually I'm just gonna drive past like every single phone possible since it took me so fucking long to find one. They'll be everywhere now. I'm pretty sure I'm meant to be on the highway slash motorway slash that road up there. Oh but it's all good. Best driver EU. Look at that, see? Fucking cor corners like a champ. Just money off of our hard what the work. hell? We work 14 hours a day and never get overtime. We're being exploited. Mm. There we go. Jesus Christ. Fucking hitting a strike or something. Speak with Freddo. He's all the way back here, and the sun looks like it's just randomly came out in Florida. 
Look at this, man. It's beautiful. Alright, boys. Let's go find out what the fuck is going on. Hey, what's up? What's going on? I can't get a flight out. Everything's closed. It's the airport workers. They're on strike. Whole place is shut down. Damn it. I need to get back to New York. What am I gonna do? Wait till it's over? And it's getting worse. Other places are threatening to strike too. Someone's been stirring up workers all over Florida. Talking about organizing labor, pooling wages, picketing. What? Someone's pushing that commie bullshit here? Sounds like it. I don't know. Mr. Roth knows more about it than I do. He's here with the friend. They're out in the parking lot. You should talk to them. God damn it. Let's go speak with Hyman Roth. And yes, we are going to run all the way there. Can't we just like steal one of those planes? I mean, god damn. Hey, what's up, boys? Mr. Roth, good to see you. What brings you here? I'm here about this strike. It's disrupting our business. My friend and I have a vested interest in seeing the situation resolved quickly. His name is Henry Mitchell. He's an agent with the CIA. An agent? What is this? Dominic, relax. The CIA's our friend. They've been partners with this thing of ours for over a decade. They're in the intelligence business, my boy, that's all. We keep their noses clean, they keep us informed. Simple. Talk to them, okay? Mm, I don't trust this guy, like... Hello, it's Dominic, right? I'm Henry Mitchell. If you're wearing a wire, you better tell me now. Take it easy, I'm on your side, okay? No wire. Mr. Roth and I have been working together for a long time. I called him when I heard about the strike. Eh, they're just a bunch of picketers. They'll cool off eventually. No, it's not them. It's the guy behind them, Alejandro Almeida. He's a Cuban-American and a fucking commie. He's stirring up the city's unions, encouraging violence. The whole situation's out of hand. The feds can't nail him, and local politicians seem unwilling to crack down on him. Yeah, he's probably got him blackmailed. What do you need our help for? Well, officially, I'm just supposed to gather intelligence on Alejandro. But Mr. Roth and I have discussed it, and... Something else must be done. I hope you understand what I'm saying when I tell you it's in both our interests. If Alejandro were to just disappear. Or there was some shit going okay down Okay then. So he was not abruptly telling us that he wants to take that bitch down. A few levels. I regret not taking a car like just spamming the A button. We work 14 hours a day and never get oh, where the time. fuck is this asshole? Exploited. They're just making money off of our hard work. The working class never gets a break. Oh, this is unfair. I'm only gonna ask this once. Where's Alejandro Almeida? Almeida is my friend. I'll never tell you. Never. You think this is bad? No, anything but that. Where you're a real dumb fuck. Ready for this? You gonna cooperate? Oosh. I give up. Ah! Is this commie shithead worth your life? Then tell me, where's Almeida? Okay, okay. He and his men operate out of the old junkyard. It's not too far from Thank here. Thank you. See, was that so hard? Because they're here, in this country. God knows what they got planned. Shit, look at that wreck! See, see if this guy would've just told us in the first place, I wouldn't have had to do some ass whipping. But, you know, these arseholes always have to try and protect the people. Or protect their leader, so, you know, guy brought it on himself. Alright, so we're definitely not going under. The guy isn't really that far away. I mean, he's like right here. We should be safe here. Uh, so it's in here. God damn, this place looks so huge. What happened? Right. Ah, shit. Punks on the perimeter. Start em, start em. Good shot, boys. Yeah.